سورة النازعات أعوذ بالله من الشيطان الرجيم I seek refuge in Allah from the expelled Satan. بسم الله الرحمن الرحيم In the name of Allah, the entirely merciful, the especially merciful. By those angels who extract with violence and by those who remove with ease and by those who glide as if swimming and those who race each other in a race and those who arrange each matter On the day, the blast of the horn will convulse creation. There will follow it the subsequent one. Hearts that day are pounding. Their eyes are humbled. They are presently saying, Will we indeed be returned to our former state of life? Even if we should be decayed bones. They say, that then would be a losing return. Indeed, it will be but one shout. And suddenly they will be alert upon the earth's surface. Has there reached you the story of Moses? When his Lord called to him in the sacred valley of Tuwa. Go to Pharaoh. Indeed, he has transgressed. And say to him, Would you be willing to purify yourself? And let me guide you to your Lord, so you would fear him. And he showed him the greatest sign. But he, i.e. Pharaoh, denied and disobeyed. Then he turned his back, striving, i.e. plotting. And he gathered his people and called out and said, I am your most exalted Lord. So Allah seized him in exemplary punishment for the last and the first transgression. Indeed, in that is a lesson, i.e. warning, for whoever would fear Allah. Are you a more difficult creation, or is the heaven? He, i.e. Allah, constructed it. He raised its ceiling and proportioned it. And he darkened its night and extracted its brightness. And after that, he spread the earth. He extracted from it its water and its pasture. And the mountains he set firmly. As enjoyment, i.e. provision for you and your grazing livestock. But when there comes the greatest overwhelming calamity, the day when man will remember that for which he strove,
And hellfire will be exposed for all those who see. So as for he who transgressed and preferred the life of the world, then indeed hellfire will be his refuge. But as for he who feared the position of his Lord and prevented the soul from unlawful inclination, then indeed paradise will be his refuge. They ask you, O Muhammad, about the hour. When is its arrival? In what position are you that you should mention it? To your Lord is its finality. You are only a warner for those who fear it. It will be on the day they see it as though they had not remained in the world except for an afternoon or a morning thereof.